to be back at the fourth episode. I am so sorry about that again. I'm so sorry about this. The camera keeps falling. Okay. So we're going to review my first slime that I made. So they've been in for in it for about 10 minutes. So look how good that is. Also, this is the fourth episode, I believe. If I'm wrong, don't come at me. But I don't know if you guys can even see it, but look how great that is. Okay, clean finger. Whoa! Okay, you guys can see it. Look. It's perfect. Now I'm gonna pick you up. What do you know? It's perfect. It's a little bit sticky still, but that's okay because it's slime. Slime's supposed to be a little bit sticky. But I'll show you a different slime that is not even sticky and it's really sticky too. This is another slime that I made. And it's sketchy. And it's red. So. That's slime too. That's like really like slime. But this is like Kids Choice Award slime or um, the slime that you get splashed with. This is so cool. This is not green. <laughs> this is perfect. You can mix it and it all comes up and then you touch it. It's not super sticky. You can push into it. It's really fun. I like this one better than my first one, but so these are my first. This is my first one. It's not super clean anymore. This is my second one. So we're gonna judge them. So my first one, when you mix it, it's really big. It, like there's more, but it doesn't. It does clump up, just not as much. My second one, when you mix it, all of it comes together. In one simple form, when you just grab it, and it comes up really nicely. Now, let's take... The texture feels a lot better on this one than this one. Definitely. This one is a lot less stickier than this one. This one's super sticky. This is my first one, this is my second one, like, there's nothing there. But there, it's like, it's still, there's still, it's there, there's stuff there, it's just like, barely. So it's like really small. So those are my first ones. And then my second one, before I show you, this is my second one that, that I made with the foam soap. Look at that. It's so foamy, cool. I don't even know if you guys can see it, but I'll face this way. Whoa, it's so cool. This one is really like slime. It's really cool. So, when you touch it, um, when you touch it, it feels really soft. It doesn't stick too much. When you mix it, it's really cool too. It like it comes together. And when you pick it up, it comes up with you. And it feels really cool in your hands because these are two soaps just put together. So you can actually wash your hands with these. With this, it's just hand soap and body gel. Then now we're going to judge it. We're gonna judge on my first one. My second one. My first one only has a little bit because I thought it wasn't gonna work, but I have this is my first one. It clumps together really well. This is the one I left in for like a few minutes because I thought, well, it's probably done by now. And it's sticky. Definitely sticky. Really sticky. What? Now let's judge them on the way they mix. 
Okay. This one makes us pretty good. Now moving on to this one. This one makes us even better. Like, it's really good. Now let's see if they're cleansing on their stickiness. So their stickiness is This one's a lot more stickier than this one. Or let me do that test again because pushing them in. Yeah, this one's a lot more sticky. This one, my first one, is a lot more stickier than my second one that I just showed you guys is less stickier. And I like the way this one came out a lot better than this one. So I give this one a 9 out of 10. I give this one a 5 out of 10. I give this one, oh, there's a thing in here. I give this one a 9 out of 10 too. No, I give this one an 8 out of 10. Because it's not fluffy. And I just don't like it. I don't like it too much, but it's really cool still. This one, I give a 2 out of 10 because this one is not even fluffy. Like, not even close. When you go like this, all the slime cuts on. It's super sticky. And I just don't really like the way this one came out. My first. I don't want really, this one's so now I'm gonna put them all in line. I think I should just see all of them. Okay. So two out of ten, eight out of ten. This one is okay. The squishiest is this one, but this one was a. 6 out of 10. So we'll go in this slime. 6 out of 10. 8 out of 10. Um, 2 out of 10. I don't like that one. This one is the winner. 10 out of 10. No. This one was 9 out of 9. I just really, really like the way this one came out. The foam soap. So if you have soap, foam soap at home, I would put... I really suggest you doing the foam soap one. It really goes for it. Well, and it looks really cool when you mix it too. Just mix it fast and it clumps together like that. So, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure to like, subscribe, and comment down below. These were all the slimes that I made. You don't need any glue, you don't need any detergent, you don't need any borax, you don't need any stuff like that. All you need is some shower gel or this that I have, I have um, or rain bath, shower and bath gel. So it's shower gel basically. And you need, if you're going to do foam soap, foam soap. Foam soap looks a lot better than your normal soap, if you on a normal basis. Do what you have at home. If you don't have this, then I don't know what you can use. I'll try to figure out something to make like a slime solution. But if you don't have like a body gel at home, I promise I will find it. Let's see what's so jelly about this. It actually looks really cool. So, this is so heavy. Like the gel is so heavy. Whoa, it feels like gel. really cool and when you it's really hard to pick up it feels so cool when you put it down but then i stop playing with that so you can use any type of body gel oh my gosh i just got that in my hand got this in my hand this is what i normally use on my normal basis for a shower huh. 
So I promise I'll try to find you something. Uh, I'm gonna make one just hand soap. So yeah. Bye guys.